Earlier in Bowerstone, I went by a cellar that I said was locked, and now it should be open. Because the statue is pointing at it. So let's head down in the cellar here. And see what we got. A leather chest piece! Which is actually rather handy for us right now, if I remember right. I think, let's see, leather chest piece, yes. We will go ahead and put that on. It is pretty, better armor, That that's pretty good. Can't complain until we get something better, which should come shortly. If I manage to achieve all of the boasts on this quest, then we will be pretty good to go. Alright. Let me see if my recall point was actually set. Um, it was, so we're just going to recall straight there. When you teleport out of the world to go to a town or another Colus Gate, um, it'll leave a recall point. So if you just need to go back to town to like, sell stuff or get something really quick, you don't have to run all the way back out. The game doesn't punish you like that, which is kind of handy. So, let's enter Greatwood. So you're going to be doing some work down at Orchard Farm, are you? I knew that was your true calling. I saw Lady Grey set the opposite quest in the guild yesterday. Maybe I should pick it up. I hope you've been practicing. You'll need all the experience you can get to beat me. See you later, farm boy. A whisper. You don't know what you're getting yourself into. Also, that is a good point. Lady Grey set the opposite quest, which means that Lady Grey set the attack quest. Which means Lady Grey is evil. In case you somehow didn't figure that out. Alright. These two are coming up close. We're gonna whack them. Get them. Get them good. That was a coup de grace. If the enemy has a little sparkly, uh, birdy, tweety mark over their head, it means that you can reach over and kill them very quickly with a minor hit. I actually completely forgot you could do that until I was actually able to do it. I was just like, hmm, that guy's on the ground. I wonder if I can just press X and finish him off really quick. All right. Let's take out these guys. A bow is the better weapon for the start of the game. Because you can kite people, and when you get in a corner, you can just switch to your sword at that point. Also, it is worth noting that enemies can't attack each other. But, usually, if you use a bow, it really confuses your enemies. Because they try to swing at you, and then they miss, because you're walking backwards or walking away. It's also worth noting that we need to use our magic. Hey, Renown Boost! We need to use our magic and our ranged combat as much as possible to level those, as we won't have much access to might at the very start of the game because of the way we're doing things in order to get that item I was talking about earlier. Alright. For a second, I actually forgot how magic. It's been a week since I played this game, guys. I'm sorry. Die, bandit! Suck it! An apple pie? I love pie. I love pie so much. Alright. I don't think I, my bow is quite powerful enough to decapitate people yet, but that is what we're going for with our bow strength. Eventually we should be able to do that. Die, bandit! Man, he killed that traitor good. Good thing about bandits killing traitors um, is free stuff, <laughs> because whenever tra a traitor dies on the road, they'll usually drop something. 
And as long as we're not the one doing it, it's A-OK. -okay. Killing the trainer, that is. Uh, Alright. Normally, traders just kind of are NPCs and they just walk the roads. If a trader is special, it'll have an icon on the mini map, and usually special traders only shut up when you kill all the enemies in an area. Alright, what's in this here chest? A will master's elixir! Oh boy, that's what we needed. Just what the doctor ordered. Um, equipment. And we're gonna go and use that. To increase our manas. Manas. Alright. This entrance is closed for repairs. Please use the front gate. So we can't go that way. Actually, that is the starting point for the alternate version of the quest, Attack Orchard Farm. If you choose to do the evil method instead of the good method, you have less of a walk. Help! Help me! They're everywhere! I can't get out! Not the bees! Zap these bees! Screw you bees! Eat my auto lock on magic spells. Oh, thank you, young lad. I ain't cast me line for so long, I got me the shakes. Been eating bait worms all week. Couldn't have come at a worse time either. I've got me a fishing competition to organize. I tell you what, I'll give you free entry to the competition. <laughs> Least I could do. You'll be needing this here fishing rod. Made it myself. All right, and here's that fishing rod I was talking about, if you didn't already have one. All you need to do is cast your rod over one of them ripples there. And that explains <laughs> fishing, in case you haven't done fishing yet. Of course, we've already been over this, so I'm just going to do a ton of fishing now. Golden fish! Pike, me lad. That's a hell of a catch. Yeah, I should come back here later. I'm reviving the great old fishing competition. There's plenty more fishing spots around here, if the mood takes you. Awesome. Let's keep going. <laughs> There's bound to be something interesting around here. Um... Ba -ba 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 -ba. I think we exhausted all of those fishing spots. Oh, here's three. No, four. Wow. Okay. I'm gonna be here a little while. <laughs> Alright! So that was a moonfish, some gold, silver key. We're up to four, by the way, I think. I think we're up to four. Yeah, we're up to four. And some leather gauntlets, which we will equip right now. Boom. I think that just leaves us with leather pants. Once we get a leather pants, we'll be good. Unless we get some other armor before then, as we probably will. So it appears this place is infested again. We're gonna clear it out. A note, there is somewhat of an auto lock on feature. Wow, that guy really hit me hard. Okay, back off of this guy, oh jeez. I forgot I was playing on heroic mode for a moment. Eh, bees! Bees! No, bees. Woo! Alright, now the big guy's dead. He was the one I was worried about. Oh god, another big guy! Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! This is bad. I'm more worried about this big guy than any of these other people. little bandits are not a big deal. That big guy really hurt me. One hit from him was rough. Ow, stop! Stop that! Ninny? Jeez. That was ridiculous. Horrible, horrible, horrible play on my part. Ugh. 
I wasn't anticipating that many bandits for some reason. Alright, let's go finish this other guy off up here. Oh, B! Buzz off! Son of a biscuit. Nope! You leave that traitor alone. 